You're watching one of a series of videos where Elisa Childers and I respond to 23 progressive Christian claims, kind of like a progressive Christian manifesto that was written by Ragamuffin TV. We deal with these claims, some good, some bad, some ugly, and I'm hoping that this helps you to think biblically. Let's go to number seven. You're not going to hell just because you didn't pick Christianity before you die any more than you're going to heaven because you said a magical sinner's prayer at church camp. I've been preaching that for years. I know, right? I'm like, <laughs> read my book. It's, I wrote that in my book. <laughs> I, I completely agree. Yeah. So It's um, sad, though, that that's, there, the, that's the perception of salvation, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So here's a thought. There's a couple of possibilities. The, the, they think this is an objection to what many Christians are saying, right? So either li they literally don't know what Christianity actually teaches. So they like right. really don't know. They think that, that that's what it teaches or they don't care. And this horrible straw man mm -hmm. is a useful misrepresentation that helps them get people to adopt their false theology. Yeah. So they'll just misrepresent it to say, see, I'm the reasonable alternative. Look at how crazy these people are. Yeah. So there's a couple errors here, like um, one, uh, when, you know, there is a hell. Okay, that's what they're ultimately want to deny is that there is a, people go to hell at all. But so there, you're not just going to hell because you didn't pick Christianity. Well, well, that's true. It's not just about picking; it's about sin. Uh, the yeah. cause of me going to hell is sin. The rescue for me coming, uh, being saved from hell is faith and trust in Christ. It's His cross that yeah. saves me. But but the cause and the rescuer are, are important to differentiate. Sin is the cause. Jesus is the rescue. Faith in Christ is my part in that, which just means I didn't do anything to earn it. Yeah. They're acting like lack of faith in Christ is the reason I'm being condemned. Okay, that's not accurate. Right. People people are judged. Now, if they hear the gospel and the Holy Spirit reaches out to them and they reject Christ, that's added to their list of sins. Mm. But it's every sin you've ever committed that we stand for. And um, yeah, and there's no magical sinner's prayer. Um, that would just be a vain, magical set of words. This is what Jesus calls vain repetitions. Yeah. We are talking about a real relational experience where you respond to God's offer of forgiveness mm -hmm. and you trust in him. Yeah. That, yeah. That's and that might thing. include somebody praying with you and you even them helping you out by giving you words to repeat or something, but it's it's not about the words. It's not like a, a spell or a magical that's chant. Right. It's, it's uh, yeah, so that, that was well yeah. put. Um, in fact, uh, in my Mark series, which I've been going through, we deal with this, how in the Gospel of Mark, it's like careful work is being done to differentiate Christianity and Christian prayer from magic yeah. of the time. yeah, And magic was about the words being used and the tools and the numbers of times you'd repeat it and all that. And then they're trying to make it clear. The cool thing about prayer is that prayer is weak and powerless and God still hears it and answers. And so it's it's all about God and his power. And so the idea that I could just turn to God and be like, Lord, I, I'm sorry, I trust in you, please forgive me. And he's like, done. All that's in his power. Yeah. I'm just the weak, needy one receiving his grace. It's good stuff. I'm going to be putting up one of these videos every single day until the entire series is uploaded on my channel with a playlist. So you might want to subscribe if you want to get those notifications. But if you can't wait, there's links to the two video interviews in large form that I already did on Elisa Childers' channel down below.